Have you ever felt trapped by your phone bill? Like you're paying for features you don't need and services you don't use? Well, I've got a solution for you. Today, we're diving into how to switch to UMA, a VoIP service that could save you a ton of money. Before we get started, let's understand what UMA is. It's a voice over internet protocol, VoIP, service, which means instead of using traditional phone lines, you make and receive calls over your internet connection. Think of it like Skype, but for your home phone. Why switch to UMA? Save money. One of the biggest reasons to switch is to save money. Traditional phone companies often bundle services together, which can be expensive. With UMA, you can pay for just what you need. Features. UMA offers a range of features that might not be available with your current provider. Think caller ID, voicemail, call waiting, and even the ability to make international calls at a fraction of the cost. Flexibility. UMA gives you flexibility. You can use your existing phone number or get a new one. You can also use your home phone anywhere there's an internet connection, making it ideal for people who travel frequently. Step-by-step -step guide to switching to UMA. Research and choose a plan. The first step is to research UMA's plans and choose the one that best suits your needs. Consider factors like the number of lines you need, additional features you want, and the monthly fee. Order your UMA equipment. Once you've chosen a plan, you'll need to order the necessary equipment. This typically includes an UMA base station and phone adapters. Set up your UMA system. The setup process is relatively straightforward. You'll need to connect your UMA base station to your router and plug in your phones. Port your number. Optional, if you want to keep your existing phone number, you'll need to port it to UMA. This process usually takes a few days. Start making calls. Once your UMA system is set up and your number is ported, if applicable, you're ready to start making calls. Tips for a smooth transition. Test your equipment. Before canceling your old phone service, make sure your UMA system is working properly. Test calls, voicemail, and other features. Time your switch. Consider timing your switch to avoid any disruptions. For example, if you have a busy work week, you might want to switch on a weekend. Back up your phone book. Before canceling your old service, make sure to back up your phone book. You can usually export your contacts to a CSV file. Additional considerations. Internet speed. Your internet speed will affect the quality of your VoIP calls. A faster internet connection will provide better call quality. Power outages. If you experience a power outage, your UMA phone service may be interrupted. However, UMA offers battery backup options to help mitigate this issue. Customer support. UMA offers customer support to help you with any issues you may encounter. Switching to UMA can be a great way to save money and get the features you need. By following the steps outlined in this video, you can make a smooth transition and start enjoying the benefits of VoIP. Are you ready to make the switch to UMA and start saving money on your phone bill? Visit UMA's website today to learn more and sign up for a plan. With that said, thanks for watching and until next time.